Scientific disciplines such as earth science, biology, chemistry, and physics are based on observation and experiment. That's why scientists spend a lot of time in the laboratory. Scientists use the laboratory to make routine observations or to put experiments to the test. Because observations or experiments often involve highly specialized technical procedures, the lab can be hazardous. That's why it's necessary to know the proper techniques to be used when cleaning up spills in a laboratory setting. Trying to clean up spills incorrectly can create a hazard for you and others. The first line of defense in a spill or breakage is personal protective equipment, or PPEs. When you deal with chemicals or glass, gloves, safety goggles, and chemical aprons are essential to protect you from injury. Even if you follow safety rules and good laboratory practices, at some point chemicals will spill and glassware will break. Accidents do happen, and when they do, it is important to deal with spills and broken glassware safely in the appropriate manner. When a chemical does spill or a piece of glassware does break, do not try to clean up on your own. Alert the teacher first so they can guide you on the proper cleanup techniques. To deal with chemical spills, science classrooms are usually equipped with specialized kits. Classroom spill kits contain chemicals to neutralize acids and bases. They also include absorbent material to clean up liquids. A test tube slips and falls to the ground. A breaker is knocked off the lab bench. When glass breaks, shards and splinters are a serious hazard. First, locate brooms, dustpans, and specialized containers to deal with the broken glassware. Special bins for broken glassware are made of cardboard with heavy-duty plastic bags inside. The box is designed to be removed from the classroom and thrown away when it is full, without having to remove the bag. The design reduces the chances of injury from broken glass after it has been cleaned up. Materials used to clean up chemical spills, spilled chemicals, and broken glassware must not be placed in a regular trash can. Household trash bags are not designed to contain or protect against these potentially dangerous materials. Chemical spills and broken glassware can pose a hazard. The laboratory is safe when you follow the proper procedures for handling chemical spills and broken glassware.